We start this hour with breaking news from the Broncos. Quarterback Russell Wilson is being benched for the rest of the season with the change of coming ahead of this Sunday's game against the Chargers. I want to get you to Denver 7's Jason Grenauer. And Jason, it's my understanding the Broncos have already named a replacement as far as quarterback. Yeah, his name is backup quarterback Jared Stidham. Much more on him in just a moment, but 1A, this is really big news for the rest of the season. Could have long-term massive implications for the future direction of the Denver Broncos. So let's start with the immediate. Russell Wilson headed to the bench for the final two games of this season. Our Troy Rank has confirmed that head coach Sean Payton spoke to Russ this morning, informing him of that decision. Why? Well, the Broncos' playoff chances are slim to none. Wilson has been struggling, and this decision really protects the Broncos from a Wilson injury, which would mean the team would have to pay out $37 million in injury-guaranteed money. It also gives them a chance to see backup quarterback Jarrett Stidham in action. Now, Stidham only played for the Broncos in the preseason, but he did perform well at the end of last year as a starter with the Las Vegas Raiders. He will be the, get this, 13th Denver starting quarterback back since Peyton Manning. So what does this mean long term? Well, our Troy Rank says this likely signals the end of the Wilson era in Denver. Russ, a combined 11 and 19 over two seasons here to fully move on from the QB and his massive contract, the Broncos would still have to pay out his guaranteed money and be on the hook for about $85 million against the salary cap over the next two years. Painful, but there's been a whole lot of that in Broncos country as of late, or at least the last eight years since the team last made the playoffs. So. Wilson to the bench. Stidham gets the start. Sean Payton expected to speak down at Dove Valley this afternoon. We will stream that for you live upon Denver7.com. Broncos and Chargers play on Sunday. Our Broncos insider Troy Rank breaks it all down and more right now on Denver7.com. Thank you, Jason. Some big news. A lot of people were surprised from hearing this news this morning. Thank you so much, Jason, for your expertise. This news comes as Broncos safety Kareem Jackson heads back to Houston. The Texans claimed him off of waivers one day after the Broncos released him. So he reunites with his former team and will have a chance to make the playoffs this season. As the Texans are in the wild card race with two games to go, we have the complete story right now on our website. You know where to go. That's Denver7.com. The roster changeup follows the latest outlook of the NFL playoffs. The Broncos are nowhere to be found after their loss to the Patriots on Christmas Eve. Plus, the Raiders beat the Chiefs on Christmas Day, so the Raiders have now replaced the Broncos as the last team still in the hunt. 